Hi, I'm Dr. Andrea Vidali, and I'm a reproductive endocrinologist as well as a reproductive surgeon. We believe that the current gold standard for the treatment of endometriosis and for the diagnosis of endometriosis is surgery. Surgery being defined as complete excision and radical excision of all the visible disease. However, the pharmaceutical industry has been peddling for years treatments that are at best symptomatic and short-term lived and at worst full of potentially long-term side effects and complications. Both professional organizations in obstetrics and gynecology and academic organizations, with obviously a few exceptions, have uh, disappointed us over the past few decades as they have not been as proactive and aggressive in instituting proper policies from the perspective of education as well as setting um, guidelines for the proper treatment of endometriosis. I equate what's going on today with endometriosis with what happened uh, in the United States in the 80s with the treatment of uh, breast cancer where in a proven treatment, a proven conservative treatment in this case uh, of breast cancer which was initially proposed and, and researched by the Italians was met with incredible resistance in the United States until women, patients, clamored for a change and there was a very slow process uh, of introduction of a different approach because of institutional resistance. It is a long battle but, and there's a long road ahead of us but I think we've made amazing progress and more progress will be made. I would like to thank all the attendees to the conference who have supported us and I'd like to thank also the organizations, uh, the patients organizations who through their advocacy are probably making the greatest impact in clinical care of endometriosis today.